One of the cornerstones of the whole Forza Motorsports experience is that you have an exciting audio experience as well as you know the physics, as well as the visuals. And you know, accuracy is, is paramount in that. And the 787 is you know, arguably the best sounding car that you'll ever hear. So trying to capture that as accurately as possible is, is incredibly important. The car that we recorded was a 91 Mazda 787B. It was like the first and only uh, Japanese car that's ever won Le Mans. There's a lot of interesting things about the car, but by far the defining character is the sound. The engine is unlike anything else. It, that The four rotor scream is completely unique. With cars that are so loud, you have to be really careful. Um, the equipment we've got is rated up to a certain decibel level, and in many places this well exceeded that. So we were using very high SPL handling microphones to make sure that they wouldn't distort. Then we had these decibel pads that we put after the mic so that didn't distort. In some cases we even had to double up the pads to get even more attenuation because we were still finding it was distorting some of the equipment, it was so loud. The whole idea behind a rotary engine is that it has a chamber that rather than having this reciprocal up and down motion, it spins around in a circle. So the faster it goes, it's not really any more energy lost. So much louder than anything I've ever heard. I mean, I've heard straight pipe Ferraris, you know, I've heard race cars of every variety, but this car just takes that to a whole new level. TVR Cerberus Speed 12 held the record for me of the loudest car I'd ever recorded, but I knew this one was going to push it, and then once it started, that piercing, wailing banshee sound started to scream. It was, uh, it was quite possibly one of the loudest things I've ever heard. <laughs> 